Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. So today I wanted to do a quick demo for running stable diffusion using AMD CPU. So my hardware information is right here. Desktop AMD Ryzen 9 5950X 16 core processor. And uh, the RAM is installed is uh, 16 gigabytes. And I opened the task manager so you can able to see the monitoring information for the CPU. So it has uh, uh, 16 core and uh, 32 threads. So. And uh, for the Python environment, I installed uh, the diffusers. Let me Let me quickly show you the package I installed. I used the Miniconda to install the virtual Python 3.9 virtual environment. And uh, I installed uh, the diffusers, transformers, and the accelerate. So very basic uh, uh, setup utilizing the diffusers library to run stable diffusion. So, and uh, I will use a Python prompt and uh, right here I already prepared uh, some script. This is a very basic uh, script using wife diffusion. Only parameter I will be using is the prompt. So I will start importing all the uh, like needed uh, package and also be uh pay attention that for the cpu it's only like uh, capable of running single position so if you try the half position it will give you error all right so this one is a single position float uh, 32 and for demo purpose i turned off the safety checker here all right, with that, I will able to uh, enter the prompt and uh, start the image generating. This is uh, for one step. Default is uh, 50 steps. All right, let's, uh, yeah, let's make sure uh, we have the monitor right here and the memory is here. And uh, we have the uh, prompt ready and the command ready. Let's uh, press enter here. And uh, normally the first uh, time running because it's a uh, cold start. So it will start loading the model. So it uh, takes extra time. So usually if it's a warm start, it will take less time. And we can see the CPU has been working uh, really hard. So it's increased to almost 100%. And also because I'm also running the recording software, so it may have some impact. So as you can see, there's, there's some uh, thread has like less than like 80 percent 90 percent some others are almost 100 percent okay so it uh, completes let's uh, quickly take a look at the image yeah looks good as expected, it generated uh, yeah, just successfully. So the speed uh, is about uh, 5.98 seconds for each iteration. Um, total time took about five minutes. Yeah. Okay, so so next I will generate the game. This time I will uh, close my recording software so I will I will take a screenshot after that so 
I think that will be more accurate. Okay, so welcome back. So I did uh, two more wrong. So as you can see, that uh, it indeed uh, improved in terms of the speed. Okay, so I think uh, that's all for today. I hope you enjoy my video. See you soon. Yeah, if you would like, please subscribe to my channel. Bye-bye.